So what I wanted to do now was um, I loaded up all my data off the API that I built. But the thing that I have to do now that I realize is that these pictures, I do not have any data. If you look at, um, let's see, inspect and reload this. You can see for my API, I do not have any data for the picture. And I just realized that. So now I have to go back into Java and to fix this entity for the um, API to add, um, add information for the picture, which is just gonna be a link. And so I'm just gonna see if I can get that to work right now. Um, everything else kind of works. After I'm done with that, I'm gonna start figuring out how I can do user authentication. So then every user will be able to um, give feedback on each sushi roll and favorite it and um, also review it. And up here, I'm gonna have like favorites drop down and eventually order sushi, but a little bit at a time. So right now I need to be able to um, get the pictures loaded in. So I am going to open up IntelliJ and let's see. So right here, this is my entity. And for here, I'm going to actually need an add. So this is going to be private, a string. And this string is going to be, uh, I'm going to give it a uh, IMG link, IMG link. And that's going to be for the image link. And now that I have that, I need to add that to my constructor over here. So I do string image link image link. There we go. This dot image link is equal to this image link. Oh, what happened here? Oh, I need a comma there. There we go. So that's for that constructor. And then I need to do my getters and setters, which there is a shortcut for this. I think it is this, this, no, this one, this one maybe. Yeah, there we go. Uh, constructor getter setter so I can do my getter and setter for image link string and that puts the getter right there and the setter right there okay so I think that's all that I needed for here so now I just need to um yeah I need to re-upload this to to Heroku and then once I re-upload this Heroku I will go back to all my data to my database on MongoDB and update all of that so let's go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and push this to GitHub so then it automatically uploads to Heroku and then I'm gonna go ahead and change the data up a bit first of all I'll just see if this works I'm gonna push this up to GitHub and make sure that works so I just pushed this to GitHub and I want to make sure that my Roku is updating. I think it'll just show everything here, hopefully. And if that doesn't. Go to Roku. Like the build, everything went through, so that's good. Um, let's make sure it's finished. Okay, it's finished. So now I should be able to add to my database um, more information to that um, 
Well, I should update, be able to update all of my API entries. So, so I'm gonna try that out. I'm gonna go to an image, find an image. Uh, go to what is it? Sushi list of sushi rolls. So I'll go to list of sushi rolls and find the site I've been using for sushi rolls. Let me see if I can find an image. So avocado roll. I will copy that image link. And I've been using um, data grip. There we go. Here's data grip loading up. And it should load my last session. And this right here is just going to show all the sushi rolls. Should show all the sushi rolls that I have in there. wait for that to load hopefully we're looking good yeah there we go so if you can see it does not have the entry for um, an image and that's what we're trying to figure out if I can do now so I'm gonna go back up here and just put image image uh, link and that is going to equal this one that I just copied. And let's see if we're able to add that. If we can add that, we will be good. We'll be good. So right now I got it to delete everything, then it just add everything back and it should include that. Let's see. Okay, so it deleted stuff. And maybe added things back. Let's see. Refresh this. There we go. So now we have the image there. And so now I have to go through and add images all to these. But that works. And now I'm thinking if, no. Now I have to go back to um, WebStorm. And I should be able to add that. Because now I have an image link. Let's get rid of this. Um, what is this? Oh, it's a readme. Now that I have an image link, I can send that as a prop. So here's a sushi. Where's the sushi? Sushi card here. And I can send this as a prop. So I'll say image. Image. Image link. And that's going to equal sushi dot image link and now that's going to send that over to my sushi card and I already have props right there and then I should be should be able to load this instead of sushi image to um, what are we going to do we're going to put props dot image link and that should work. Image of picture of sushi roll. That should work. But I also, let me just add a couple more. So I got an avocado roll, Alaskan roll. I'm gonna copy the link to this Alaskan roll. Copy image link. Um, go to here. Avocado roll, Alaskan roll, and do the same thing. I'll just do that there. Image link, and we're going to make that image link fit there. And we're going to do this asparagus roll. Copy that image link. Um, it was right here, asparagus roll. Never heard of asparagus roll. I guess that's a thing that there and now we have three of them and I'll do the same thing with the database we'll just run this drop everything and add it again it looks like we complete it refresh that and now I should have three images and those three images should take care of the first three here well it should have picture of sushi roll 
that did not work okay um are these images links broken copy image link no these image links work So I think it's probably the way it's formatted. HTTPS. Uh, let's see. Go back to here. Source. Okay. I don't know why that isn't working. That's the image link. Props that image link. Let's see. Image link, sushi image link. That's what I'm sending it. I need image link right there. Props dot image link. Sushi image link. Okay. Yeah, that should work. So I'm not sure what I'm doing wrong here. Okay, let's console log that and see what it's actually um, giving me. Console.log, I'm pretty sure it's something that I'm messing up. Props.image link. And so I'm going to go here. That should be console logged. It's undefined. So that's an issue right there. And oh, I think I might know. Okay, let's see. That's this. Let's look at this one here. Image link is no. Okay, that is weird image link should not be no that's why I'm getting that issue but when I look at my API let's go let's go to post and I think I still got that up and let's update this So see if it's going to give us our images. Image link is no. Okay. So why is image link no? Is it because I put IMG link? I think that may have something. Let's see. IMG link. Sushi dot. Well, it shouldn't even be no here because this is coming from the API. I think because I'm supposed to put IMG link and I messed up somewhere, maybe here. Let's see if I do IMG link there. that to ing as well ing i'm not sure if this is going to fix it hopefully it fixes it and i just want all of this to run okay refresh this and that changed the ing link okay so now we go back to here oh wow that actually did work so we weren't getting anything, it was no. So now if I go back to my actual website. So now when I go back to the actual website, my local host, where's local host? Got too many tabs open, here we go. Uh, local host right here. Refresh maybe? Come on, are you kidding me? IMG link, okay. So now let's go back to WebStorm image link because that's supposed to be IMG link. Uh, 
hopefully that's what it was. Go back there. And there we have it. I only did three, so the other ones aren't even going to come up. So I just need to populate the rest of that. I could do it, I guess, while I'm sitting here. I'll do a few more. Um, so that just means that I need to go here. And I'll do these three right here. So I got a baked salmon roll. I will, well, let me, yeah, baked salmon roll, copy the image, go back to data grip, and baked salmon roll, IMG link. There we go. And I'll just copy this so I don't have to do it again. G link which is bad practice because sometimes you mess up and you sit and wonder what's going on with your program and it's because you copied and pasted something wrong I think we've all been there before okay so big salmon roll this bath street roll copy the link uh, blue crab roll To copy the link. Go. I'm not gonna do it for all of these. That's a lot. But maybe just three more, just so I have a couple pages going on. And I would do IMG link like that. And I will copy and paste this. That shouldn't hurt. Um, Boston roll. Copy image, Columbia roll, copy image. Okay, I did something wrong. British, oh yeah, that's right. British Columbia roll, and of course the California roll. Copy the image, and the carrot roll. link okay I guess I didn't get that copy okay that should be good for now go back to here this isn't going to do anything I need to actually add it to it first okay, gotta go there it drops it and adds everything to it looks like it was successful refresh this and we have a couple of we have 10 of them which is good give us two pages to load um, and I think it may since all that's in there it may just work now so the avocado roll let's see the second page there we go and it should be one more oh I did oh a couple pages in this last one here I feel like I should just do caterpillar roll and cherry to this teriyaki roll might as well. Caterpillar roll. Copy image link. I don't feel like it would be complete without doing those. Caterpillar roll. Image link. There we go. Chicken teriyaki. Image link. And classic roll. And promise this time I'm done image link well for now and then we're going to do the same thing here drop everything add it back so refresh see if we got yep we got up to what was this one? Oh, this one's a chicken teriyaki okay so I missed something this is a classic roll it should be up there that uh, crazy boy roll this should be here there uh, time with that update this and we are all good to go and if we go back to our program which is right here those should load. 
let's refresh so we can get the beta. Laskin, okay. We're looking good. I think it was just one more. There we go. Okay, well, that's it for now. See you guys next time.